Now, the National Junior College Basketball Tournament got underway this morning in Hutchinson, Kansas, and in Lubbock, respectively, for the men and women. The Kilgore men were the first to take the floor, making their first appearance since 2013. But the KC Rangers would have to face the home team, Hutch, in their opener. Midway through the first, KJ Jenkins gets the handoff from Tyson Banks and buries the three ball from the corner pocket. 34 for him on the day. A little later, Deshaun Nelson on the drive leaves it for Paul Otiano, who misses the bunny but gets his own rebound and lays it back up and in off the glass. Still in the first, Jenkins over to Nelson, who blows by his man. And look at this, stuffs it with one hand, hammers it down. Kilgore trailed by one at the half, and the second more from Mr. Nelson. Penetrates, hits the one-hander, falling away in traffic for two more of his 29 points. But the host, Hutchinson, began to build a bit of a cushion and held on to take down Coach Brian Hobright's Rangers 95-86. to Kilgore wrapping up a great season at 17 and 6. Meanwhile, the 9 seeded Trinity Valley Cardinals taking on Brunswick out of North Carolina. First half, Derry Moore, the Tyler Hylum flies in there for the putback. A little later, Jakevion Buckley. Check out the nice up and under move for the lay-in. Then the Oregon State signee, Deshaun Davis. He comes up with one of his four steals on the day and manages to get his off-balance layup to fall for two of his 35 points. Then Moore doing some serious work down low. Banks at home and won 14 points, eight boards for the Rose City native. Cards, though, fell behind and trailed 52 to 45 at the break, but they quickly erased that deficit after halftime and went on to win it 96 to 91. Trinity Valley advances to play number eight Cowley, Kansas at 4.30 p.m. tomorrow. And hey, how about the Texas Longhorn volleyball team? They are final four bound for the ninth time in the last 13 years as they beat Nebraska today three sets to one.